Hi, I'm Luke Streeter, co-founder and chief delivery officer at Flinder. This short video will show you how to create bank crawls in Xero. I'll be using a demo company, which you can access through My Xero or Xero HQ. So if we move to the video, you can access bank rules by either clicking on reconcile or going to accounting bank accounts. If you find the item on the bank statement that you'd like to create a rule for, and then if you click on options and then click on create bank rule, it will take you to the screen where you enter all the criteria that you need for the rule. My example here is an item from a bank bakery. So I've treated it as zero rated for VAT and I'll allocate it to general expenses in this example. It is really important to consider the accuracy of the rules here though. You need to be specific enough that you get the treatment correct, but if you make it too general, you risk reconciling items either to the wrong VAT, to the wrong general ledger code, and make sure information inaccurate. For example, Google could be Google Ad Spend, it could be G Suite for your email, and therefore you'd want to treat those items differently. Once you've entered all the criteria, click Save, and it'll take you back to the bank reconciliation screen. You then find the statement line, click OK to apply your bank rule. Alternatively, check out the video that I've done on cash coding where you can clear all bank rules in one simple click. Hope you found this video useful. Be sure to check out our ebook on 10 common mistakes that startups make using Xero. Thank you.